Hey, it's Annie and welcome back to my channel. I my hair looks okay. In today's video, we are going to be going through my trash. It's, it's, it's full. It's full, you guys. So some of these things are repeats that I've shared before, but then you know that I really love it. I'm still using it, so yeah, so that's that. Let's start with this. And this is the Hydro Boost Body Gel Cream from Neutrogena. It has hyaluronic acid and I get the fragrance free. I love this and it's been a repurchase for me, but um, I've been using another lotion and I think that I have it in here. <laughs> but I do really like this. Sometimes I use this at night now, so I was using it when I get out of the shower and I love it. But like I said, I've been using another lotion now. And sometimes I layer it and sometimes I don't. Like I will put that lotion on, put this on top, but I love this. It just gives your body a really nice glow and I feel like it locks in all the moisture. So I do really love this. I have another one, but like I said, since I'm using another lotion, I don't know if I'm gonna repurchase it because I'll show you why. So the other lotion that I started using was this one. This is the Alpha, uh, Skin Care Healthy Radiance. It has 12% glycolic AHA. So this is what it looks like. It's kind of a thickish cream. What I don't like about this, I, I hate the packaging. You flip up this little thing to push it out and it's so hard to get out. It's really, really stupid packaging. This really should be put in a pump. It really, really needs to be. So I heard about this from Angie from Hot Flashy. I was using an a, a, a lotion, a body lotion with an AHA in it, and I was buying it from Target, and we moved here, I cannot find it. And I don't remember the brand name, but I can't find anything, like I couldn't find any one there at all. So then I decided to order this one from Ulta because that's the only place I could find it. Um, for me, online, I can't get it at Ulta in person, but I do really, really love this been using it. The reason I started using it is I felt like my skin was looking a little crepey. This I will definitely repurchase because I feel like I'm seeing a difference. I feel like I have more of a glow in my body right now, so I really do enjoy that. This is from Australian Gold. It's the mineral sunscreen with SPF of 50. This is for your body. I do really like this. It does have a white cast. It's messy that way, which I don't like. It does really, really well in my pool. Like I feel like I put, I can put it on and it stays on me. And even when I reapply it, I feel like it's still on me. What I don't like is this stuff is a pain in the butt to get off. I mean, I have to scrub this off. And even when I scrub it off, sometimes I get out of the shower and I still have it on. So because of that, I don't think I'm gonna repurchase this anymore. I have some that I'm still using up and I don't think I'm gonna repurchase it because it's just too, much of a pain to get off. I have three of these. This is my holy grail hand cream. This is from Neutrogena. It's the Norwegian formula hand cream. I use this on my hands and feet every single night before I go to bed. I wish I had known about this. I say this every time, but I really do. Many years ago, my hands were so dry, cracked, bloody, gross, especially when I was doing hair because you're constantly shampooing somebody's hair. I wish I had known about this. This is a game changer. Even when I lived in Chicago, I started using this because my dermatologist told me about it. It's the best. All you need is the size of a pea. That's all you need, just a little amount, put it on your hands, then go ahead and put some on your feet before you go to bed. I'm telling you, this stuff is fabulous and it's affordable, so I love it. This is something I just started taking. I actually have, I don't know if I have my mini one because I started off with a mini. I don't know if it's in here. Do I have my mini one? I don't see my mini. Yes, I do. Okay, so I started off with this. There we go. Started off with this and then I went to this. And by the way, all the details will be below. This is the Nature's Bounty Extra Strength Hair, skin, and nails has argan oil, has biotin, um, has antioxidant C and E, and hyaluronic acid. So I and I have another one. So this has been a repurchase for me. I've been the only thing I don't like. I've been enjoying it, but the only thing I don't like is I don't like when they color. Like I don't know what dye is in the vitamins. I don't know why they have to do that. I don't see. Like it doesn't say what that is. Um, 
Yeah, it doesn't say what it is, but it has so many good vitamins in it. So this is like my little multivitamin that I take right now, but I feel like it has made a difference in my skin. I feel like it's made a difference in my hair. I have had a break breakouts lately because I got off home hormone replacement therapy. If you missed that video, I'll try to remember to link it. But in general, I just do feel like my hair, my nails, I keep them on the short side. I get gels done because I don't like to wear long nails because I cannot get anything done and they drive me crazy. But I go in every three weeks and my nails get like long. Like I need to keep cutting them down. But really, really love this. You're probably like, why are you taking that if you don't want to have long nails? But I still want to have strong nails and it helps my skin and it helps my hair too. So it's not just because of my nails. You know what I mean? Another vitamin that I take a supplement is fish oil. So I take 1200 milligrams, um, 360, it says 1200 milligrams, 360 of omegas three. I started taking these a couple months ago and this is actually my third bottle. I have another brand that I actually prefer better than this one. This is Nature's Bounty. Um, the other one I'm taking I think is Carlson or I forget what it is, but I'll show you in my next empties. But I feel like since I started using this, I was getting heart palpitations. And since I started doing upping my walking and making sure that I walk, I walk two and a half miles five days a week. And since I started really being consistent with it, not just doing it three days or four days and taking this, I feel like it's controlled those palpitations. So I don't know. I'm just going to keep taking it. It does help with my skin as well. It helps with my muscles, so I really, really love taking that. With any of these supplements that I'm sharing, check with your doctor first. I'm not telling you to get those. Just check with your doctor. Make sure that they don't, you know, um, react with anything that you're taking. I had a reaction one time to some supplements. Look at another hand cream. <laughs> I, t I had a reaction with some supplements, so be careful. The other supplement that I take every day is this one. And this is from Innet, I-N-N-A-T-E, Choice. It's a probiotic sufficiency. I used to get this from my chiropractor back in Chicago, but now I just order it online. I will, I will add the link below. I, when I started taking probiotics years ago, I tried taking them and they just upset my stomach in, in a bad way. <laughs> So I was afraid to take any more. My chiropractor had these and so I started taking them and I swear since me and my family have taken this, we have been so much healthier. When your gut is healthy, you are healthy. And even when we've gotten sick or gotten something, I feel like we get over it faster because our, we have a healthy gut. So definitely love these. They are expensive. I think they're like 45 bucks or something like that and you get 60. So. They're expensive, but I feel like it's, I'd rather spend it on something that's going to help me than get sick and then spend, you know, hundreds of dollars on doctor bills and on medications from the doctor. I'd rather spend it on that. That's how I look at it. My Vital Proteins Peptides. This has 20 grams of collagen per serving. It's good for your hair, skin, nail, joints. And it also has, is it 17 or 18? It is, uh... 18 grams of protein in two scoops. So again, this is unflavored. I use this every single morning. This is how I start my day. I have a cup of coffee, I put two scoops in, and then I will go for my walk. So I have that protein, so I'm not walking on an empty stomach. I love this. I do feel like it's made a difference in my joint, my skin, my hair. Um, I don't know if this, the combo with these two is helping my nails because I didn't feel like it was really doing anything for my nails, but my nails are starting to grow. But I do put a gel over it, so, you know, whatever. But uh, this has been a repurchase. I have one that's about up to there right now, so I just placed an order yesterday. So if that's something that's a repurchase, 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 I'm not going to stop buying it. This is the Colleen Rothschild Hair Mask. I use this as a conditioner every single day. I have, I just opened a new one and I have a backup. So anytime I'm like, when I'm done with my backup, then I'm going to get another backup of this. I absolutely love this. I know you guys love it too. So I just use a little bit. I just scoop it out because it's just like a cream. You can't see it's totally empty. Oh my God. It smells, I can still smell the container. It smells so good. She needs to make a perfume with the scent. It is, it smells amazing and I love what it does to my hair. I just went to my hairstylist this week. 
or was it last week? Last week, <laughs> I went to my hairstylist to get my hair done. And she's like, oh my gosh, your hair's so soft. Seriously, it's this. It just gives my hair, it makes it soft, shiny. I have more volume with my hair. I know I'm having kind of a bad hair. This is second day hair for me. But even second day hair doesn't look terrible, really. So I love this. Definitely, definitely recommend I know so many of you started using it because you heard me rave about it. It's really, it's really, really good, you guys. The other thing that when I got the set, and I don't know if you can get the whole set anymore, I think you have to get it separately, is the hair serum, and I love that as well. So when you got the set, you got one, I think it was like that big, so I have a bigger one now, and I don't I don't see my empty serum thing, but I think I'm keeping that, and that's why I didn't put it in here, because I'm just going to keep it as like a little travel size, so when I'm you know traveling, I'm just going to fill it up with my other one. This is a repurchase for me. Where is my magnifying glass I feel like I misplaced it yeah so this is a repurchase for me this is the CeraVe nighttime moisturizer it has three essential ceramicides niacinamide and hyaluronic acid and it's oil free which I like so this is my nighttime moisturizer but honestly you could use this during the day if I'm really really dry sometimes I will put this on with my other my other moisturizer and skincare as well for my morning routine, but normally I just save this for at nighttime. The only thing I don't like about this is I hate the pump because sometimes I will squeeze it and it will just squirt everywhere, but otherwise I really do like it. It has really good stuff in it. This is something I just started using. This is the Listerine Healthy White Vibrant for a wider smile in five days. I use the Clean Mint. So this you can use twice a day, but I only use it once a day because I just don't have time to do it twice a day. But I do it at nighttime before I get to bed. So you just add a little bit. I just put a little bit in my cap, pour it in a cup, put it in my mouth, swish it around for about a minute or so, spit it out. You don't rinse this out. So I just have to not to be gross, but you have to keep spitting and spitting and spitting because I don't want to swallow any of it. I absolutely love this. It doesn't make my teeth sensitive or anything like that, but I'm a coffee drinker. So I use whitening toothpaste, which I don't think I've shared yet, but I use whitening toothpaste, but I just felt like I needed something else as well. So I really, really love this. I like to stay on top of it. I'm never going to have really, really bright teeth. I just, I'm just going to have a shader, a lighter shade of yellow. <laughs> That's all I'm going to have. But like I said, I'm a coffee drinker. I, I can't expect to have white teeth unless I stop drinking coffee and honey ain't going to happen. I need my coffee in the morning. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying, girl. Okay, this is the Physician's Formula Perfect Matcha um, Cleansing Balm. It says a three-in-one melting cleansing balm for all skin types. And I bought this because people had said that this was a... Um, I'm still using my It Cosmetics Balm. I love that. But I, I purchased this because I was curious because people said it was like the Green Clean, although I don't use the Green Clean and I shared... There are some ingredients in there that I didn't care for. I think this might have similar ingredients, but I can't say that for sure because I, I can't take the darn label off. I tried taking the label off and I cannot take it off. Like if I take it off, I'm gonna peel the whole thing. You know where it says peel? And then I go to peel and I can't just get that. But it smells really nice. Kind of smells like Green Clean. Kind of smells like that. You can see I used just about all of it up. It comes with a little spatula. It retails for just under $14. I can't remember the exact price. It's between $13 and $14. You only get um, you only get 1.4 ounces. And I just feel like I feel like that's a lot for drugstore. In my opinion, I think that's a lot because I, I went through this pretty quickly. So if you compare it to like green clean, if that's what you use, I would say just get the green clean then because I just don't think you're saving money. You're saving money at that time because it's cheaper when you buy it, but then you're going through it quicker. So I don't like this. I don't recommend it. I didn't think it did that great of a job getting my makeup off. I really had to get in there and work to get my eye makeup off. So I don't know. I, I just wouldn't recommend it. I, I didn't like it. This is the Pixie Hydrating Milky Mist. It has hyaluronic acid and black oak. Um, I really enjoy using this. This is the last thing I put on before I put on my sunscreen. So I do all my skin care. I spray this on. I let it dry and then I put my sunscreen on. So I really love it. It has a really nice um, like little mist. And I'm trying to think of it's... I don't smell anything. 
I don't think it's scented, but it just feels really refreshing on my face. I love that. This is the Crest 3D White Strips. This is the Vivid Gentle. It says it gently removes 10 years of stains. Now remember, if you are drinking coffee, your teeth are not gonna be bright white, but this did help a lot. And this, I believe you could only use twice a year. I thought that's what it said on it. So it's not something that you use weekly or anything like that. You just have to get through this and then you can do it in another um, six months or so. But I really did enjoy it. It didn't make my teeth like extra sensitive or anything like that. Like I didn't notice it at all. I definitely would purchase it again. I think it was 25 bucks. The only thing complaint I have is why are we putting in this big box? Because you get it and you just get these little packets. I think this is kind of a waste, this packaging. I think it's really stupid, I don't understand. This cream I shared before, I just ordered another one. This is the Sagely Natural CBT CBD Cream. It does not have THC in it. I will not use anything that has that in it. But this has, um, it's an all natural ingredients, non-greasy, lightweight, cooling to the skin. It's, it's called Relief and Recovery. Has not, doesn't have any parabens, synthetic fragrances, no artificial colors or dyes, no sulfates, um, and it's cruelty free as well. But it just, when I have soreness in my, well, even when I have my numbness in my arm that I experience, or if I have pain in my neck, or if I have pain in my back, or my knee, or whatever, I put this on and it, it helps. So I absolutely love this. I have another one. When I get low, I will be ordering another. I think I've been through several of them already. This is the Beauty Blender Solid Pro. And I've used this up. It's really gross and disgusting. But I usually purchase one of these and it, it I go a year before I have to buy another one. So what I love about this is it cleans my Beauty Blender sponges. There's some foundations that stain and there's nothing that's going to get out but at least it's clean so I use this every single time before I use my beauty blender I clean my brushes with this too it doesn't seem to dry them out or anything I really love it it's been a repurchase for me and I'll keep repurchasing it the Chanel inimitable mascara I'm not going to repurchase this I don't like it I did like it it stopped working on me right now I'm using Dior show that one's okay too but definitely not going to repurchase this and the Chanel Primer, I do really like this, but I'm using a drugstore one right now that I'm liking, so yeah, I'm not gonna repurchase that right now. I still would recommend it, but I'm just not, I'm not using that right now. One of the toothpastes that I use is the Crest 3D Brilliant White. You can't even see the tube, it's just all twisted. I love that, that's one that I use. Another one that I use is this one. This is the Crest 3D White, and this is, I'm trying to think what the difference between the two is, I don't even know, but it's. It's Crest 3D White, Arctic Fresh, Fresh removes up to 80% of surface stains, whiter teeth, guaranteed. Again, I drink coffee, so I don't expect a miracle, but I just feel like this helps maintain my teeth so they don't get really yellow. The It Cosmetics Tight Line. I enjoyed using this on my lower lashes, but I'm not gonna re repurchase it just for that. Um, I, I purchased this because I thought I wouldn't have to use a a liner in my waterline because I thought that's what this is for. No. Mm -mm. It's it's nice if you want to use it for your lower lashes, but I'm just not going to spend that much money to do that, so I'm not going to repurchase that. This is the Chanel Chanel Soleil Tan de Chanel. This is the bronzer I use. It's pretty much the only bronzer I use. I've I've tried some other ones, but I just always go back to this one because I just love the way it looks. It just feels like it looks natural on me. But I just, I bought this several years ago and it just was starting to get kind of grody. So I just ordered another one. So I did have some left, but sometimes you just, you know, it's, it was uh, several years old. It was time, it was time to go. You know what I mean? And always keep this, by the way. I do that with a lot of stuff, but this for sure, because this will dry out if you don't. So make sure you keep that. I love this mascara. This is from MAC. This is the Up For Anything Lash. It's waterproof. They don't make it anymore. This stuff is amazing. Why, Mac, why? Why did you do that to me? Why did you taunt me? Why did you tease me? I really, really, really loved this mascara. I found it at Marshall's, and I was gonna get a couple, but I don't wanna get a couple if it was lousy mascara. So I bought it, and I loved it. I went to get back, go back and see if there were more. They were gone. Why did you do it? Why do companies do that? I don't even know. The 
Emile Cordon lip balm. I love this. You guys know that I've used this for several years now. I have another one that I'm using and they sent me a new one as well that I'm enjoying. This one was the, it doesn't matter what flavor, they're all good, but this one was Cocoa White Coconut Cake, number 72. Love it. I use this every single night before I go to bed. It lasts a long time. It makes my lips nice and doesn't plump them, but it just prevents them from getting dry and cracked. I love it. Sometimes I will use it in the morning too before I put my sunscreen on. I'll put that on as well. I just really, really love it. The Kiehl's Avocado Eye Cream. It's been a repurchase for me. I just repurchased another one. I love this. If you have dr like dry under eyes, like mine were peeling dry from a product that I was using. So if you get that, this is amazing. I love it. It's really, really light. It's not heavy. One of my, actually might have been even several subscribers had told me about this and I love it. Absolutely love it. I love when you guys share. So make sure in the comments below, I think that's it. Make sure in the comments below, Make sure you share your favorite skincare, makeup, hair product, like what you've repurchased or purchased, what you like there's like, you can't live without kind of a thing. Let me know in the comments, even if you you maybe haven't shared it, maybe something you just discovered, let me know in the comments. I love testing and trying new things. Sometimes they work for me, sometimes they don't. We're all different. We all have different um, expectations. Our skin's different. Even if my skin is the same as yours, it still may not work on me, the way it works on you kind of thing, but still always share. I'm always looking for, for trying something new. So that is it guys. Thank you so much for joining me. I really, really hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. Click that button below, hit the subscribe button too. I share new videos every single week. Also make sure you click that notification bell too because anytime I share a new video, you will be notified. And that is it. Thank you guys so much. I will see you all in my next video. Bye.